baby's pressing on my nerve. Bring, 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 bring. <laughs> my tummy looks big from the side. I am at the hospital. <laughs> oh my gosh, like I'm so nervous. But I'm also excited as well. Like, yeah. But Christmas cuts guys with Lalo and Max, they said that it must come at half past six. And I only just found out now that my C section is scheduled for nine o'clock. So we're gonna have to wait until nine. Like, but yeah, better early than late. I'm ready. I'm just leaving everything up to God and. Like in the morning when I left, I was feeling so emotional because I left my kids. But okay, my kids are with my mom, so I don't know, I guess I'm okay with that. I don't know, it's just like when you're a mom, you want to to be there um, for your babies, like every step of the way. But obviously, I can't split myself, so... And Gazinula is not even feeling well today. But yeah, I'm just happy you got a baby this year. Let me show them. Let me show them you, baby. Here's your hand. I don't want to disturb him because I know he's going to cry. so much pain guys like oh <sighs> yeah ne? but i just received an injection like another injection because um like that pain medication wasn't really working i don't know what it's even called um so yeah let's see um they said that um after giving me the injection i'll probably sleep and i can't wait for that because I've been trying to sleep but I couldn't because of the pain and yeah it's now five o'clock <laughs> haven't eaten like the whole day I stopped eating last night at nine and so yeah this is what I ordered let me show you guys jelly and custard um apparently I have to start it slow with eating so I also ordered this some chicken veggies and some gravy and also some mashed potatoes looks very good and yeah and apple juice so basically this is the first meal um, in hospital Good morning, guys. Um, yeah, so today is day number two, and 
it's five o'clock in the morning. guys. <laughs> so I just had an injection. Um, had my blood drawn out. Apparently, it's a another blood sample that they need after you give birth, and I have been given um, that same medication that you see right there behind me for pain and um yeah so as soon as that is finished i'm just gonna quickly go and take a shower um started being mobile yesterday well with the help of the nurses of course <gasps> brutal guys like but yeah so they said that the more you um become mobile then the more it gets easier and better for you with regards to pain so yeah guys i was not able to sleep throughout the night like literally i feel like i've been up since yesterday like i haven't been able to sleep i don't know why like my mind is just all over the place and oh my gosh like i'm just grateful to god and i'm i don't know i think i'm overthinking things and so it's been difficult for me to um sleep um maybe it's also because it's a new space and stuff like that but yeah so this is day two i am going to be taking videos um of um how the day is going to go and yeah this is my morning meal cheese and tomato sandwich and some tea I have never showered so quickly in my life with so much pain so they brought in the baby around 20 past 5 in the morning so what they do is they take the baby um, at, at 10 uh, p.m. to keep um, the baby on their side like in the nursery so that the mother can be able to rest because obviously you're still going through the 
a process of recovering so they brought him back um at five at five twenty a.m and then um i was able to uh rush and take a quick shower but he was crying so much so i just wanted to get it over and done with and yeah i finished up even brushing my teeth um in one of the sinks um like in the room and yeah because he was crying and then now that i'm done with everything <laughs> hey guys lingan saying shish saying shish he's now asleep and i don't want to wake him so i'm gonna wait for him to wake up and then we are going to breastfeed each other but yeah nonetheless guys i'm happy with my recovery like it's getting better um obviously if you are in hospital and going through this c-section process um recovery thingy um on the second day you can ask for assistant um but i didn't want to do that like today because i just want to get um used to um like recovering on my own because i am going to be alone um at home as well like not alone alone but I don't know guys i'm just independent like that and i just want to like recover not quickly obviously because you don't want to do any damages but you know i also don't want to be um like sitting around and wanting to be carried all the way um so yeah i just want to recover quickly not quickly but um at a good pace and yeah so here we are Sikezile. we are relevant now i look so much better i was so crusty in the morning um however i feel like my face is swelling up i don't know whether it's me or but yeah and i also have um this this ring almost like a ringworm um on my face here as well don't know maybe it's the reaction of um after delivery or whatever but yeah i think Uguti, i'm just going to put over selena and all of this is going to go away but yeah adios hey Hey guys so it's still um the second day i am just like so happy i got to i managed to sleep finally hey well, guys i managed to sleep wow and it was nice and short but like very nice <laughs> so i'm just glad to go see i finally got to sleep and yeah baby is sleeping oh my gosh guys my baby is behaving so well and i'm so just so glad like i'm so appreciative i just took out my my um needle drip wait what do you say i've taken out the needle that i was using for the drip though so that's nice and yeah the pain is better so i've realized that you just have to keep taking medication every time when they give you so that you won't feel the pain because once the the medication wears out um from your body i shame hi where's that in bed so you just need to make sure that you take your pain meds um before it even um wears out in your body so yeah that's where i'm at and yeah i'm happy guys um they said that i'm going to be leaving on saturday so we came in on wednesday and yeah doctor said that i'm going to probably most probably going to be discharged on saturday so i can't wait for that and um yeah okay so what also helped me to sleep is the medic the injection that they gave me don't know really what it's called i forgot um because i've been feeling like a bit itchy 
and then this started off yesterday and i just thought that no you know it's because i'm itchy um because you know when something is um maybe tight maybe on your panty or um like nje i don't know guys but yeah i was itchy and i just sort of like thought that it was normal because it wasn't that itchy and then um today i was still itchy but then um i, I had this on my face now like things were um coming out like yesterday was this side and then today it came on this side but then now it started to um be sore almost like my face is cracking and so um yeah the nurse the nurse helped me um she told me that it does happen um it's one of the side effects of the epidural um after um so that's why i'm probably itchy and also that's why my face is a bit um like so um yeah so and then she gave me this um other injection on my thigh and yeah it went down like okay there's still like marks and stuff but i'm just glad that it's not um like painful uh almost like a, 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 a scratch like i've got an open wound so yeah so i'm just happy with that and yeah oh my gosh guys like i'm so drowsy it's now seven and i'm about to eat i'm so drowsy and i'm starting to be itchy again oh yeah bonjour lama side effects guys brutal let me show you what i'm going to eat guys anyways oh galaxies i am having my jelly and custard again today mm, yay fish and mash with some veggies good morning good morning good morning <laughs> oh my gosh yeah so today is um day three yeah today is day three people guys i am so drugged but yeah today is day three and yeah we're feeling much more better um i don't have itchy skin anymore like i'm not itchy anymore but i am tired i am currently breastfeeding <laughs> currently breastfeeding i haven't taken a shower today because you guys are so tired and the baby came in um around five and um, I had to feed him and he feeds for like an hour so yeah that's where we at I have my breakfast here I even forgot what I'm going to be eating like what I ordered but I'm gonna have breakfast I've already had um, tea like in the morning around I had tea around six yeah I had tea around six um and then now i'm going to have my breakfast and yeah so hopefully i am going to be leaving on saturday so that i can go home and rest because i need it um yeah so happy uh vlogging how today is going to go and hopefully it is going to be a good day um yeah so yeah i'm gonna have tea again um also gonna have all brand um, this is to help me with my digestive system so that i can be able to pass number two because that's very important um apparently you can't leave the hospital if you haven't passed number two and yeah this 
<laughs> here's what i'm having looks so delish and i'm so hungry like guys i'm starting to like eat a lot now that i'm breastfeeding like i feel like i'm always hungry so yeah mm -mm. Mm -mm. <laughs> oh my gosh now i look fresh i think i look fresh and nice okay so i am done taking a bath what time is it now it's 10 o'clock i took a shower actually and i have changed into this these pjs are so comfortable like and i can nurse with it like you know you get this little bala but i feel like the low part is a bit tight like these pants I don't know if you guys can see them like i feel like they're tight well they are tight but not too tight like on my body but i would have preferred to maybe get it a bit loose i took an extra small because i saw the shirt is like an oversized um cut so i thought that even the pants won't be as tight but we are here now and i wanted to change into something different and yeah i used to, i feel like i don't even have a choice at this at this point in time so yeah i've changed i feel guys i feel so light lighter today i don't know whether if it's because the doctor just told me that i am going to be discharged tomorrow so yeah everything is looking good um obviously i still have pains um immediately in jail when the um, medication just wears off um from my body then obviously I, that's when i start to feel um, uncomfortable and the pain more so on this side i don't know why but yeah more so on the right and yeah so i'm waiting for hubby because he said that he's on his way and yeah and then we'll see how the day goes i'm thinking of um watching show max um the wife because i didn't get to watch it yesterday and now that hubby is um on his way i want to watch it with him mm. Mm -mm. you no know, have some alone time this is where we at guys this is my tummy now <laughs> i am going to miss it especially putting things <laughs> in my tummy when i eat but yeah that's about it let's see how the day progresses
good morning yeah no. so today is saturday and just woke up time now is five o'clock and yeah already i have to eat because so yeah i have to eat because i've just taken medication um for pain so yeah i have to eat now because obviously you have to have something in your stomach in order for you to um not react in a bad way to the tablets and stuff so yeah this is what i'm eating it's just um bread and and tea yep so that's how my day has started and yeah throughout the day i'm also going to take you guys through how it's going to go i am so excited that i am going home i miss my babies so much i can't believe that i left home as a mother of two and then now i'm going back as a mother of three oh my gosh sounds so crazy but yeah it is what it is <laughs> Wait, 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 wait. Oh my gosh. <laughs> 